Hello everyone, in this video I'm going to show you how to make a WhatsApp chat widget for your Squarespace website using ElfSite. So first of all we need to build a widget. Now there's no actual code involved in this, it's all visual so it's a really simple thing to do. So if we head over to ElfSite you'll find a link to this in the description. And if you haven't got an account already you'll need to sign up here where it says sign up. Once you're signed up or logged in we need to find the WhatsApp chat application. You can see it here and you can also find it under the chats filter as well. So if we click to create widgets and that takes us through to the widget builder. So you can see we've got some templates over on the left to get started and then what the widget is going to look like down over in the bottom right. I'm just going to pick any one of these templates. I'll go with Ricardo, the boat expert. A job that after an extensive quick search of Google in 1998 is something that doesn't seem to exist. But no matter which template you choose, they're all fully customizable from the name, caption and picture down to the welcome message, button text, colors and icons. So we'll click to continue with this template and then we can name the widget. But probably the most important part is the WhatsApp phone number. This is the phone number associated with the WhatsApp account you wanna to use to handle the chats through your website. Once the phone number's in, you can either leave this design as it is and move on to the next step, or you can work through each of these tabs, customizing it to match the style of your site. So there are quite a lot of things that you can change here and they're all pretty much self-explanatory so I'll leave you to customise yours. And through the power of video editing, the speed and duration setting in Premiere and some high BPM music we can jump to my final widget. So we're done in Elfside. Actually we're not done because I forgot to grab the code. So if we click save. And then we need to take a copy of this code which we can do by clicking in the box. Now we're done in Elfside so we can... Shh. Now we're done in Elfsight, so we can jump over to Squarespace and add the code to get this thing up and running. So there's a couple of places we can add this depending on where you want the widget to show. If you only want it to appear on certain pages, then we can add the code just to certain pages. To do that, we'll click on the thingy icon next to the page. Then we'll go to Advanced and paste the code into the page header code injection. Hit Save. And you'll see the chat widget. Or as it says in my notes, chat widget. But you might want it to show on every single page, including your terms and conditions and your disclaimers and your disclaimer policy policies, terms and the cookie policy and the policy for the EU privacy policy and the California terms and conditions and your mock-up of Squarespace's homepage from 2004. To do that, we'll remove the code from the single page and then click Save. Then go back to Settings, Advanced and Code Injection and we'll paste the code into the header box. Hit save and our widget will be installed across the whole site. All that's left to do then is to find someone with WhatsApp who can visit your site and send you a constructive, carefully considered message to test that everything's working the way it should. So as always, thank you ever so much for watching. I hope you found this video useful. If you did, leave us a thumbs up below. If you're not already, consider subscribing to see more stuff like this. And hopefully I'll see you in the next one. See ya.